Hey everybody, welcome back to Sort This, our new show, Sort This. <laughs> Continue. Uh, this is a new show where our evil producer Matt Danovic gives us a list of games and we are forced to sort them into some form of a top 10 list. Like so. And today's episode is going to be Top Sidekicks. You didn't feel confident just like throwing it? Well, here's what happens. Top Sidekicks. Yep. Hey! <laughs> I'm getting better at this. Yeah, you get real good Top at Top sidekicks. You ready, Dodger? Yeah, I'm ready. Number one on the list is Garrus from Mass Effect. Number which, one is correct. Yeah, would be yeah. up here. So I'm going to do another one of these. Oh, shocker. Yep, yep. He's a fantastic sidekick, although he's not always around. Maybe he wouldn't be as good of a sidekick if he was there all the time. Like, really like, hey, just want to talk about my feelings again. You're yeah, like, that's true. Nobody would like him as much. They'd be like, God, yeah. Garrus is the worst. Yeah. He yeah. acts like he doesn't care, but he totally cares. <laughs> he, cares <laughs> he cares too much. much. He cares too He's much. always here. Also, he uh, his job in the game is to just sit in the back and snipe for you, which is pretty sidekick. True, which is pretty, great. Pretty sidekick. Yeah. I'm going to put him up there, because you and him get like a pretty good connection by the end of Mass Effect. I agree. Next up is Dom from Gears of War. You're gonna get good at that one day. I'm, I'm amazing, so. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put Dom kind of like mediocre status. Yeah, he's he's kind of yeah. low for me because he is, he is a sidekick, mm -hmm. for sure. There's yeah. no debating that whatsoever, but I don't feel like he's a super developed sidekick, even though we go through a lot of stuff with him. Like we help him with his yeah. wife and all oh, that. Oh, yeah, we do help we him do, with I his mean, wife. I mean, we try. We get him there. We try. We She's try. dead. Spoiler alert. She's Spoiler. Dead. I mean, he winds up sacrificing himself, but in a way where it didn't, it wasn't necessary. Yeah. You know? It's like you go through like... two whole games of shooting, like, just countless dudes, and then he's just kind of like, ah, oh, this is the one that's hard. This is the guy. Yeah, you know what? I'm just over it. Yeah. And I think it's implied that it's because he lost his wife, and he's like, I'm oh. done. So maybe Dom sad. isn't your sidekick. Maybe he's his wife's sidekick. It's a strong marriage. Between these two guys, they're kind of the same, right? Shooty guy that helps you, but yeah. this guy's but way better. Garrus is so, ah, yeah. and Dom is so, yeah. ah. He has a cool beard, though. Cool beard. Can't even grow one. Cool beard, so. no beard. Ooh. Cat face, though. <laughs> Cat face, it's tops. Third on the list is Tails, AKA Miles Prower from the Sonic universe. Yeah. Tails is, Tails' entire name is like sidekicking what Sonic does for a living. Sonic's name is I Go Fast. Tails is I Tail You Around Four Miles. <laughs> like, really? I'm impressed that you came to that conclusion, just... but the way that you decided to explain it was a <laughs> little mean. It was a little, a little weird. Mean. It was a little weird, yeah. yeah. Hmm. What about the last name? Prower. 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 Oh, no. I didn't even. I just. Because it's not spelled that way. Wow. It's just spelled. <laughs> Oh, Prower. Why didn't I ever never get that? I don't know. That's was... even worse. He tails you miles per hour. That makes less sense. Actually. <laughs> I'm actually more mad at Sega now for like ham fistedly okay. putting one well, extra pun like per let's... hour, right, kids? Let's talk about Stupid. Tails. No, I like Tails because Tails is established as being a very smart person. He also helps you How, transport where did that come from? to yeah, and from because true. he's he's a mechanic and like works on his plane and all that. Oh, that's He and right. Garrus that's could right. hang out. That's true. Tails could be like, Garrus, I see you're not making any progress on that <laughs> weird thing you're working you on. You need Let me help you a mechanic. Out with this guy. <laughs> I yeah. enjoy Tails a lot. I don't think that he's an annoying sidekick whatsoever. He's, that's true. He's useful. You know? Yeah, he shows up, he leaves, he shows up, he leaves. And he kind of defines what it is to be a good sidekick. He shows up to help you and then he pieces out for yeah. you to be the hero. But he's from the Sonic universe, which I find to be Pretty pointless. Mediocre. Yeah, yeah. so I'm gonna put I him... love Sonic, so we're not friends anymore. <laughs> well, that's okay. I'm willing to take it. What? To... What happened? Who's <laughs> yeah. gonna be here? Whatever. Yeah. I don't care. I'm not gonna fight yeah. with you. This I'm man gonna... has a wife not worth it. that he died not for. Worth okay? It. What has Tail ever did? He has a plane. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Next up, we got Clank from Ratchet and Clank. Oh my god, it oh, worked. Man. Oh getting... my god, we both did it. I'm getting really good. Ah, yes. Although, I don't want him that high. No, I, I think he belongs right where he, he is, I actually. think, man, I made the argument that Dom doesn't really have much of a personality, but Clank, I think, more than, like, yeah, I anybody mean, so far. at least has some stuff go on. Yeah, I mean, you go through things with Clank, 
But clank literally, for the most you go through like walls and yeah, walls you and literally you ride clank sometimes. <laughs> Watch so, out! <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, tails at least just like carries you like yeah, a bro. Yeah, 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 clank yeah. is like hop on. I'm not too big a fan of clank. He's kind of forgettable to me. I think I played maybe 20 minutes of a Ratchet and Clank game. Sorry, internet. They're really fun games, and as as they've developed, like clank has become more of a of a character equal. Well, ratchet? I mean, that's the sign of a good sidekick, right? That people apparently liked him so much that they elevated him to, like, co-star instead yeah, of sidekick. Yeah, but he but, still, mm. he hasn't had enough making him matter to me. Yeah. So. Well, he doesn't have I'm enough matter. He doesn't have enough matter. <laughs> so, little guy. Ah, woo! Hey! Next. All next. Right. Next. <laughs> next. <laughs> Next on our list is Rush from Mega Man, also yes. a robot yeah. that you can also ride. Yeah, kind of a theme. But like so, so vibrant, so full of life, unlike Clank. He's that yet, is true. he's yet another one who's mostly there to just be like, "Hey, dog, do you need to get somewhere? Because yeah. I can, I can do that for you." Yeah, which is fine, but. Do you, wait, yeah. so he calls Mega Man dog? Do you think he just thinks everyone's a dog? Yes. That's deep. Yes. That's Rush has more depth than There's dog. so much depth! <laughs> There's so much depth to Rush! I like Rush because, uh, first of all, dogs are like cool sidekicks to people. So mm. robot dogs naturally sidekicks to robot yeah. people. And he can transform into things. That's yep. cool. It's all cool. And he has one name. None of this, none of this pun crap. <laughs> I'm not even going to get into what... He could, I mean, I guess this is kind of a pun, actually, because... He rushes, yeah. That's, uh, I, was gonna, I was gonna let you have that, though. I wasn't yeah, gonna say I was anything. I'm not good at puns. <laughs> Turns out, not, not good at puns. Next up, we got Cortana from the Halo series. Oh, um, man. Now, now, I like to throw everything into the middle first, <laughs> but I'm just gonna... Somewhere okay. in there. I don't yeah. know, I love Cortana. She's so useful. She's she like really useful. She's very awesome sidekicky. Sidekick. She just shows up. Fits in your pocket. Yeah. Which is great. Uh, I kind of have a problem with Cortana because it's like it's totally marketed to 13 year olds where it's like, hey kids, you want a right. semi naked robot lady that fits in your pocket and does whatever you want? You got it. But Give like, us sixty dollars and she's, but she's yours. She's useful. She is useful. You know? But yeah, I do agree. She didn't need to be like see through and naked, you know. Right, and she just, every every generation of game, she just gets more revealingly naked, which yeah. is kind of just like, come on, we're guys. Like, we're upping the graphics, yeah. so yeah. Mm -hmm. we're going to make sure that she's a little bit shinier right. around the booby area. She's like, she's like an infinitely intelligent AI, but she's just like, woo! <laughs> <laughs> like, what is that? So she was programmed. It's not her fault. <laughs> she was made by True. purbos. True. If you were designing, you know, an AI for Purvos. I'm sure Master Chief is a total purvo. Right. It would look like Cortana. Yeah, so absolutely. Well done, lady. Useful. Yeah. Good for purvos. Yeah, and she, I mean, yeah, she's everything you need in a sidekick. Yeah, she's great. Next up is Claptrap from Borderlands, who I'm yes. going to put very low. Yeah. Very I mean, low. All right, Claptrap. You are funny sometimes, but it gets old. Well, it's not only that. I love Claptrap. I think Claptrap is a great character, mm -hmm. but I don't think that he's a sidekick, really. No. Because he hangs out wherever he wants, being funny, and then every now and then, like very yeah. rare story missions, he'll come with you. And every now and then he gives you a mission, but doesn't go with you. Yeah, and he you doesn't, know? I mean, even when he comes with you on the missions, he's not really doing anything useful. He's actually kind of like wasting your time or causing trouble and then like berating you yeah. for his own Being mistakes. Like, I'll open this door and then you have to yeah. deal with waves upon waves right. of dudes and, and so like, he finally up opens there, the door. there, minion, bull. Yeah. And you're like, you know what, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know what, Claptrap? That's what I think. Boom. Oh, dang. Last place. Yep. I remember Borderlands 2. <laughs> Did not enjoy you. So vividly. <laughs> Next up, we've got Navi. Or is it Navi? Or Navi? Uh, Navi? Na Navi is the race from Avatar. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, different fandoms. It's uh, just Navi. Yeah. yeah. Let's, you know what? She, she or it has to go above Cortana because Cort she came before, but they're doing basically the same job. She does it for a cooler hero, and True. well, she could be naked under the little light thing. We don't know. Yeah, we don't. Is. We don't really know what it Navi is, looks like. It is My Nintendo. issue is that Navi, you don't remember Navi as being helpful. You remember her as being endlessly annoying. Can I get a Navi impression? Hey, listen, watch out! It's just that over yeah, and over and over and over and over again. Bad. But you brought up a good point earlier that Navi was one of the first sidekicks that was there to really help you navigate a 3D world. Which yeah. I thought was a very good point. Yeah. And uh well, and her name's a pun too. <clears throat> so guys, could True. we cool it? True. Game designers, can we cool it with the puns with every name? But I don't know. She's 
people don't remember her as being like a good sidekick. They remember her as being right. Like, that's super, true. Super I'll annoying. give it that. Like, if you remember a character as being annoying, you're probably not going to rate it very high. I'm with you. Uh, I'm going to keep her here for now because it's way too much I'm sorting. Just, but I'm gonna oh, slippy, you know what? I'm going to slippy slap these down a little bit. Maybe, just maybe just for the those. pedigree because like she is better than Clank. Be one of those. Okay. I think that. Well, and I, I think hate that's tails what I want. Because puns. God, you're the worst. But I hate her because puns. Ah, well, we'll deal with that later. Cool. They'll just be best friends forever. <laughs> Next up is Daxter from Jack and Daxter. Okay. I will be honest. I didn't play the Jack and Daxter games a lot, but I do remember Daxter being the like the wise guy mm -hmm. until. Stuff got real, and then yeah. he was like, "Yo, dude, we should get out of here." You oh know? yeah, he was he like was that guy. Kind of, didn't have a, a long attention span for danger. Uh, I played the Jack and Daxter games during my parents' divorce, mm -hmm. so I'm gonna put them there and just share that. <laughs> I with expected the it to be like hearing you <laughs> say that, that and well, then looking up. Fourth like... best thing that ever happened to me: my <laughs> my parents' divorce. <laughs> Sorry, Mom, I know you're watching. I don't, know that. I don't know. I don't remember a lot about uh, Daxter other than that. that he's, he was half, like... he's half otter, half weasel, I believe. Okay. He used to be a, a dude, like a regular dude, and then oh. he got transformed wow. into an otter weasel. That could, maybe forever. Kind of sucks that like you were like a co pilot in this yeah, relationship and you got turned into an otter but thing, and then you're like, you're Jack. sidekicked is still your best friend, despite Aww. despite you going to him and being like, dude, do you yeah. see this? And like, they, like, they clearly have a pretty cool, tight man. relationship. Like, they're always they're always helping each other out. Yeah, man. And I mean, let's be honest, even though he's a bit of a coward, sometimes that's a good thing. He's like, hey, Jack, you're, you're in it too deep, man. You gotta just, we gotta let me be the otter coward for a second and pull you out of danger. Sometimes that is a good sign of a sidekick, mm -hmm. being able to say, let's walk away, man. Let's walk away. Just like my parents. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, we got Yoshi from, I guess, Super Mario World, but like just from Nintendo. I thought you legitimately forgot like <laughs> where Yoshi was from, and I was gonna be like, oh. no, 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 no. And I think this is a rightful. I'm really glad. You I know, I was it thinking like that this. too. I was like, wow. You know what? I think I'm kind of okay with this. Yoshi is so iconic and great yeah. and wonderful. And Here's just... the thing. When you're when I was a kid and I was playing uh, Super Mario World, I was so excited to be Mario and controlling like the coolest hero. When Yoshi showed up, I was more excited than I ever thought I could be. I was like, I'm riding a yourself. dinosaur that eats eggs and spits shells. I, it can't get any better than this. Like we were talking about before, Yoshi has graduated to being like True. a full-fledged character all on his own. Like yeah. he was a good enough sidekick. He still doesn't really talk. Larsel! He does that. One more time. Larsel! I hope we can get a close-up on the fact that that noise doesn't come out of your mouth because it's just, that's super creepy. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's great though. Like he's super cool and he's a dinosaur. I also feel like he deserves a top spot because Mario sacrifices him so many times to get places, and that's so unfair yeah. And he's and always awful. totally cool with it. He's yeah, like, all right, I'm just like, gonna like run worry, really fast and don't fall. Don't worry, buddy. Yeah. I don't take fall damage, so yeah. I'll come meet you well, later. Well, he never dies. He just runs away really fast. He's just like, I'm out. Not when he falls down. Wait. Does, when you like jump Yoshi, and on. then you just like peace out off of Yoshi so you can get that double jump and he just falls. I'm blowing my own mind here for just a second, but Yoshi comes out of an egg. Yeah. But when he dies, he just pieces out. Are there like a billion Yoshis all named Yoshi in Mario I mean, World? that was the concept of Yoshi's Island. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna keep them there. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah. just the prototypical. All Yoshi. Yoshi's. All Yoshi's yeah. are awesome. But that's super sad. <laughs> Nintendo, that's really messed up. You shouldn't you shouldn't do that. Don't kill Yoshi's. Now comes the point where we get to do a final sort of all of these. So go. Oh wow. Every time. Every time you just uh, All right, well. I'm and, okay with uh, this. Yeah. Hands off. Wow, Real really? hands off right now, okay. yeah. Wow, I mean, we both hate Claptrap. So <laughs> Claptrap real sucks. Yeah. Clank real sucks. Dom's pretty low on both of our lists. Navi is pretty low on both of our lists. I really wish we could disagree on anything. Because <laughs> this We're is always... We're just so in sync. We're just so always, in sync. Well, somehow I, I look like the 13-year-old perv here. Yeah, Cortana. you do. You Ugh. look like a big old pervo. I'm right gonna do there. a last sort. I'm gonna put Rush even higher because he really is the. Is this just so people don't think you're a pervo? Yeah. Or well, is this I want you my top three to all way. be rideable characters. You oh. know what I'm talking oh. about. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what? 
Ta-da! 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 All right, well, cool. Your list sucks. Mine's better. Okay, rock, rock on. Show's over. <laughs> that has been Sort This. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is Neil's list. This is my list. But what's your list? Did we miss somebody? Is there another top sidekick that totally should have been I'm here, sure but there's a lot of wasn't? Also, do you guys have an idea for another Sort This? If you do, you should put it in the comment section, and if we like it, we will shout you out, and we'll use it, and it'll go right here. Maybe we'll even put your name right here, too. Yeah, maybe. Courtesy of guy or maybe girl. Courtesy of guy or girl. Probably won't. One of these. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.